I'm changing the title of this piece to Real Wealth, Family is Wealth, Your Offspring is Wealth, Your Partner in Life is Wealth, much more than the clues that you can trap, uh, the money you can make, the moonshine you can drink, much more important. Anyway, I've got these, uh, they're not fondue sticks, they're, I think they're um, marshmallow roasting uh, sticks that I got at the grocery store. I don't know if they still sell them. I think they sold them last July, but I've got a few of these. And uh, I'm going to try to anchor her closer to him, sort of like she's leaning into him. And uh, there we go. And I'm going to jab it through there. I I got to remember I've got an armature in here in her. That's a true form armature, so I've got to uh, be careful. I'm going to just hammer it in. here. And pound it in just a little bit further. There we go. Now I pushed his head in just a, a little bit. It's uh, If you remember correctly, I did his face separate. So I'm going to uh, Reposition it. Makes a great view from here to there. Because his eyes are looking right at her. And, uh, you know, a weathered old mountain man. His heart's melted by his lovely wife. Okay, I'm going to put another fondue stick. <clears throat> right down through there and that will give me two points of anchoring that I need. Make a new point. Now she has a foam uh, thorax under there so I got to uh, hope it works. coming out the back. Nope. Oh. So now I'm going to clip that off. There we go. Now see they're more leaning in towards each other which is fine. I'm going to change the dress just a little bit uh, because I want her leg over here just a little bit further. So I'm going to cut off this uh, part of the dress right here. And I've got, I think, and, oh yeah, I got uh, her leg armature right there. So I'm going to cut that off. Right there. That's a lump of clay that I can retrieve. Some clay from this a little bit. <clears throat> Pushing the clay up and under, up and underneath her to hold her in place. Yeah, she's gonna stay there. Gotta make sure it's not leaning too far this way. So I'm going to back her, back them both off just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Put a lump of clay underneath this clay. I'm going to scrape off this dress detailing because I've decided to do some other stuff with it and it ain't going to work with uh, the detailing that's on it now. So I'm just going to take that back a little bit. Well, that work. <laughs> yeah. 
know, sometimes you just have to do what you have to do. I'm going to also make more folds in her dress uh, than I had before. Because, quite honestly, the dress was uninteresting in its flat form. And so I'm just going to attempt to put some folds into the dress. Just to give it more interest. I mean, these dresses were made out of uh, deer hide or elk hide, depending on the season. The uh, tandem by, uh, uh, well, they, they used the brain of the animal to tan its hide. And uh, it, it almost is like felt to the touch. That's how incredible the uh, brain tanned leather feels and uh, to keep it waterproof they would smoke it uh, as well that would uh, waterproof the skin and uh, yeah I'm liking this a lot better I think what I'm going to do is just do a ragged bottom on it instead of a a, a uh, oh, fringed bottom Not sure I'm going to beat it. I don't know. I think uh, yeah, I'll put a roll of skin coming down this side here so that uh, her dress comes out to about right there. And I'm just going to take that dress and put it over there. Oh, yeah, that looks a lot better. A little more balanced. Push him in just a little bit to her. Because he's leaning back a bit. There we go. That looks good. Yeah. Haven't decided quite what I'm going to do with him yet. Gotta straighten that leg out. It was starting to bend this way, so a uh, little adjustments here and there. Maybe put his head to where he's looking at the baby. I'm trying to see the baby. sort of straightens out his body. His body was looking kind of odd. I'm going to go ahead and roll out this clay for the arm. Just so I can sketch it in. Yeah, that looks good. I know the back looks pretty screw rough right now, but it's gonna all work out just fine. Mm -hmm. My idea right now is just get everything in place so I get a feel of what it's gonna do. And see, this, this shows a loving feeling, just having that hand on there. I mean, it's probably the, the, you know, these guys had to be pretty rough and tough. And for him to soften for someone be his partner like for life uh, that really took something I like that I like that feeling a good line there too 
Yeah, it's going to look good. It's going to look good. All right, well, that's going to be it for today. I'll uh, pick this up uh, next time. And uh, like I said, this is going to be called The Real Wealth. Or, or let's see. Now, I'll, I'll work out that title a little bit better, but Real Wealth is, is Family. And that really is true. But if you want to see a video on how I created her and how I created him, I have two separate DVDs on that. Uh, one is a, a female holding a baby and one is creating a mountain man. So uh, if you want to uh, uh, purchase those DVDs, uh, just go to the link I'll have uh, in the uh, description of the video down below. All right, everybody, have a great night, and I'll see you next time.